how this loan is structured, it's structured so that 60% of the total investment is a loan and the other 40% is investor capital or equity that has come into Belize and is already in place. Um, under international financial standards, a loan that is 60% uh, part of the investment and the other 40% equity is considered a safe loan. Under most standards, debt to equity tends to be a little higher, so this is considered a safe transaction. The syndicated loan subscription was closed last year in July. Uh, in the last minute, one of the foreign banks restructured itself and um, had to pull out due to regulatory reasons. The reason is that the new entity they created was no longer allowed to lend to Belize by their regulator, so they had to pull out. With that gap in the, in the subscription of the loan, the investors decided to continue the construction of the loan using our own funds and to invite a new participant into the project once the project was completed so to reduce the risk of the project. It's important to know that these types of transactions are, the, are riskier when the project is under construction and once the project is ready, risk is re strongly reduced. So at this point, our project is ready. We are already in the commissioning phase of the project and we expect to begin crushing sugarcane within the next three weeks. Uh, that being said, any participant to this loan at this point in time sees their risk significantly reduced. Due to this, uh, we, it saddened us to say that this issue was politicized and it's been given a negative uh, connotation. And uh, due to this negative media coverage, we decided to um, actually use another lender, uh, an international lender, to cover that participation. Um, we, we, are, uh, we have already proceeded to inform the Social Security Board that uh, we will be covering the funds from another source.